I'm Katie with your Galco TV Tech Tip. DC motors have two primary advantages, speed variation and torque. Speed variation is accomplished by changing either the armature voltage, field voltage, or a combination of both. For example, a motor with a base speed of 1750 RPM and an armature voltage of 500 volts, direct current will run at 875 RPM with a 50% reduction in armature voltage. Utilizing both methods of speed control will provide a wide variety of potential speed ranges. Armature voltage control is used for speeds below base speeds, which results in a constant torque capacity. Conversely, shunt field control is used to obtain speeds above base speeds, resulting in a constant horsepower capacity. Torque can be defined as a turning force that tends to provide rotation on a shaft. The primary advantage of the DC motor is that it can develop constant torque over a wide speed application. Power supply is an important consideration in the application of DC motors. The most common method of providing DC voltage to a motor from an AC line is through the use of an electronic drive. Depending on construction, the drive will provide a pulse waveform similar to the perfect voltage from a battery. These pulses are characterized by a form factor that is defined by NEMA as power supply codes. These codes are based on the quality of the power output. Application concerns include drive cost, operational cost, reliability, and output power quality. Stay tuned to Galco TV for more information on DC motors and additional tech tips. Make sure to check out our other videos and be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to our channel.